very important concept is quantization. Then we say that so what you understand by quantization? Again, right now, quantization. Quantization, said the D-I-O-N. That's the quantization of charge. What do you understand by the quantization of charge? That time I would say that's very simple. And one electron is shifted, two electron is shifted, therefore, whole number of electron will be shifted from one body to another. Is in this condition we say that in the phenomena of quantization, that concept is Q is equal to plus minus N E. This is a quantization. What do you mean by this concept? Any. That means N is their positive integer, is positive integer. That means its value is 1, 2, 3, and so on. This is a whole number. And E is the amount of charge. That means 1.6 into 10 to the power of minus 90 coulombs. Hence, there is N is equal to 1. Then Q is equal to either positive or negative, I don't say positive or negative, both 1 into E. E is 1.6 into 10 to the power of minus 90. It is equal to plus or minus 1.6 into 10 to the power of minus 19 coulomb. That means when one electrons are leave from that one, that body is positively charged, 1.6 10 power minus 90, and those one take around this negative charge of the electron, then its charge is 1.6 10 power minus 19 coulomb. And it is equal to the charge of one electron. It is equal to charge of one electron. When n is equal to 2, then q is equal to plus or minus 2 into 1.6 10 to the power of minus 90. It is equal to 3.2 into 10 to the power of minus 90 coulomb. It is equal to twice of e. If there is a number 3, then q is equal to plus or minus 3 into 1.6 10 to the power of minus 90, then plus or minus 4.8 into 10 to the power of minus 90, it is equal to 3e or so on. It means we are taking out the value e, twice of e, twice of e and so on. Hence, this is a principle of quantization. And what do you mean the quantization? Quantization is the total amount of charge or the charge on a body is always the multiple of positive integer or the number, positive number with the charge of electron is called quantization of charge. That meaning is charge cannot be divided into further parts. It means charge never be possible on body thrice of E by 2. We are not taking out because one electron, two electron, three electrons are leave from the body. Then it does not taken out in this way. Or one by two of E again and one fourth of electron it means yeah, this is a, for example that's my example this is not a book example but this example is most important for you suppose this is a pen aap, uh, your friend will not have their pen so you will pen ko kya karenge? Usko dena hai. that's our friend so we will break it into beat mein se break down then half portions ko de denge, half half and from this side you are writing it is possible never same as, this is quantization, same as the charge, full electrons is shifted from one body to another or another body is taken out, full number of electrons and then number of positive integer. It means 1, 2, 3, 4 and so on. That's called quantization and that simple concept is finishing. Then, there is another very important word. What is the word? Word is fundamental charge. This is one marks question. What do you understand by one uh, fundamental charge or the basic charge? This one is called fundamental charge. This is called fundamental charge or oh, this is known as basic charge. Basic charge. What is meaning of this fundamental charge? Fundamental basic. Kya matlab hai? Iska concept ye kehta hai ki that's the least possible value of charge on a body. Least possible value of charge on a body that is E, that single charge of electron is called fundamental charge. Again, we define the least possible value 
of charge on a body is called fundamental charge or basic charge and its value is 1.6 10 to the power of minus 19 coulomb okay we discuss some problem related to quantization and what you mean the quantization and how much amount of charge on a body we discuss on this point come next that's next part parents there if a charge on a concept is cu double plus copper double plus you find the amount of charge what is the charge on this one very simple n is 2 correct n is 2 e, there is no positive negative because it is positive integer e is equal to 1.6 into 10 to the power of minus 90 coulombs then the charge is positive this is plus and n e is the formula n is 2 e is 1.6 into 10 to the power of minus 19 coulomb then the charge on cu double plus is 3.2 into 10 to the power of minus 19 coulomb and this is the amount of charge on cu double plus that's concept another question that's very important question which amount of charge is not possible on an object this is a question right suppose there are four alternatives are given first 1.6 10 to the power of minus 19 coulomb second alternative is 3.2 into 10 to the power of minus 19 coulomb third alternative is 3.2 into 10 to the power minus 17 coulomb and fourth is 3. Point, sorry fourth one is none of these none of these none of these then what is the correct answer i repeat the question question is which one amount of charge is not possible on a body which one amount of charge is not possible on a body this is question and there are four alternatives which one is correct so we have discussed on the answer answer is first answer 1.6 to the power minus 19 this is equal to one electron one electron it is a charge possible this is equal to with this is equal to twice of electron okay and this is oh is it an answer no this is not an answer is answer kya hona chahiye aaiye apan discuss karke is answer ki taraf chalte hain isko dekhte hain this is an amount q is equal to le q is given 3.2 into 10 to the power of minus 19 and find out currently e is 1.6 10 to the power of minus 19 therefore n is equal to 3.2 into 10 to the power of minus 19 divided by 1.6 into 10 to the power of mm, sorry there is a 70 oh sorry this is a minus 70 and minus 70 and minus 19 16 1.62 ja 3.2 Minus 19 shifted plus 19. There is n is equal to 2 into 10 to the power 2. It means 2 into 1 double 0. That means 200 n. n is a positive integer, yes or not? This is positive integer. That means it is an also correct. Also, also. Then answer is none of these. None of these because all these three charges are possible on a body. Then you calculate it by the formula of Q is equal to any. Then we get the result. Clear? Then next concept and we are going towards next.